Well, good morning, People's Church, Newton Abbey. It's Pastor McKim here with the wee weekly update as normal. And yet it's not normal because we've just entered into another lockdown because of the high rate of transmissions and the casualties along the way. People have lost their lives. And so the government is worried and there's a crisis. And they've asked the churches to actually go online rather than open the buildings. Now, we are not opened as a building. And we're in the drive-ins. But we just feel as a leadership this morning, we prayed about it. And the leaders have decided that this weekend, we're going to go online on Sunday morning and as usual on Sunday night, as usual on Monday night and online on Wednesday night for the Bible study. We're doing that and we'll keep you updated if there's any differences or any changes to that. Because we want to do what's right. We want to keep you safe. And we want to do what's right by the government because they're trying their best and we're praying for them. And so as we pray for them, we want to also be complimentary to them. And so we're doing that this weekend. So on Sunday morning, we'll be online with the breaking of bread. So don't forget, we're, we're coming together uh, from 10 o'clock onwards. If you're on the 1131, you can tune in because it'll be the same service. And you'll get it again. So, But we're on from 10 a.m. on Sunday morning. Don't forget, we're coming to worship the King. No matter whether there's a lockdown or not, we're coming to worship the King online. You in your home, me in my home. We're worshiping the Lord together. And don't forget to bring your emblems because we're going to remember the Lord, have communion together, staying connected together around the communion and also we're going to hear from his word and I have a lovely word for Sunday morning in the midst of all this. I have a lovely word for you for Sunday morning. Then Pastor John will be online again on Sunday night and then we're back on Monday night online with the call to prayer as usual and again a lovely thought on, on mon, mon for Monday night on the call to prayer people are just tuning into these services and then we're back on Wednesday night uh, for the Bible study we are adapting to our situation remember what Pastor John said last week we don't want the lockdown to conquer us we are here to conquer it and we are here to adapt to what we're in and how to address it and let's do it in a godly way and a practical way and in a spiritual way. So that's what we're doing. And so we are here online from Sunday morning, Sunday night, Monday and Wednesday. And if there's any changes, we'll keep you updated. So just keep tuned to the updates because you'll hear them periodically from service to service. And like this wee one that we do weekly. So may the Lord bless you. Stay safe. Stay safe. Keep praying. Pray for the government. Pray for Stormont that they make the right decisions. Pray for, for Westminster as well. Pray that the Lord will undertake. Pray for the chaos in America. Pray that something good will come out of it all. But also pray for you and your family and for the people's church. Will you pray for the pastors? We're trying to make the right decisions in these days to help you, to keep you safe and also to stay connected as the church the blood-washed church of Jesus Christ. So, so brother and sister, listen, just let's dig in. Let's do what we need to do. Let's get through this together and let's trust the Lord to lead us, guide us, guard us and protect us. And most of all, to drop handfuls and purpose upon us as we follow in his footsteps. So may the Lord bless you. If you're on your own, don't forget that the pastors are only a phone call away. Lift the phone. If you're worried, if you're lonely, if you're anxious, if you're down, if you're sick, just phone us and we'll be praying for you over the phone to help you through this. Let's pray that the Lord will bring good out of all this and that the name of Jesus Christ again will be glorified in his church. As his church, we're up for this and we're going to get through this. Why? Because he said, He'll never leave us nor forsake us. So keep trusting and don't forget the people around you. Phone around, encourage one another with a wee phone call. How you doing? Are you all right? Do you need any? Listen, let's do that. And, and yes, you're doing it already. So God bless you. And we commend you for what you're doing, brothers and sisters. So, but listen, we're online for Sunday morning, 10 a.m. onwards. And then Sunday night online 
Monday night call to prayer online and Wednesday night's Bible study all online and we'll keep you up to date okay as we go along so may the Lord bless you I want to say thank you this morning as well for your support in all of this even from the very start of the lockdown I want to say thank you on behalf of the pastors for your prayers I want to thank you for your support your phone calls your whatsapps your emails and also your generosity and your giving thank you for the donations thank you for your tithes and offerings that you've given to the lord's work i know some folks are wondering what the, what we're going to do uh when we're online listen just hold on to your envelopes at the moment and also if you want to give online the details are on the website so if you want to do that go on the website and you'll get the bank details there. But that, let's not panic here. Let's just trust the Lord and see how things go. Because we'll hopefully be back into the driving shortly. But let's just stay online for now. But I just wanted to thank you for your support. Your support and your encouragement. Because I appreciate even the tax to say that the, you appreciate even Linda and myself leading the worship. Only two of us. It's not the norm for every for but listen, it's a, it's been a blessing as far as we, we can tell. And also we're keeping the church the services simple. Um but I just pray that you'll enjoy the journey with us and that we'll get through this together in the name of the Lord. And we will we will let's stick together. Stick together. Remember, we're 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 of the same family. We're part of the same family. We're brothers and sisters in Christ. Listen, let's keep on going on with Jesus. No matter what, at home and also together online. In the name of Jesus, God bless you, brothers and sisters. If you're from another church, let me encourage you to pray for your pastors. Pray for your congregation. And thank you for tuning in. I know there's people around the province and I know there's people around the, uh, the nation and around the world, I got a text from Scotland last week, a text from Southern Ireland Republic last week, and also got a text from Canada uh, last week. So people are watching these services online. So let's be encouraged and let's be inspired and let's keep on going on because he's worth it. And always what I say to you, he's worth it. And he thought you and I were worth it. When he died on that cross for our sins, he thought we were worth dying for. I believe he's worth living for. So God bless you. Listen, whether it's online or in the driving, we are serving the Lord together, connected as God's people. So be encouraged and be blessed. And we'll see you on Sunday morning online around the Lord's table. God bless you. Stay safe.